There's a lot of things going on in the world of trending news today, especially when it comes to Apple. Classic move, Apple. The Apple credit card is now available. Apple sent out email invites to some of those who signed up to be notified that the card was indeed now available. A larger public launch is due later this month. The card promises no annual fees, late fees, or over the limit fees. Sign up and management of the card is totally handled through the iPhone's wallet app. Centoya Brown, who was sentenced to life in prison after being convicted of killing a man who bought her for sex when she was just 16, was released from a Tennessee prison early this morning, this after being granted clemency back in January. Okay, now I'm pumped. I have the coolest thing to share with you. It is for the science and history nerds out there, but even if you're not into it, just look how cool. Scientists baked sourdough bread with the yeast retrieved from 4,500-year-old Egyptian pottery. Physicist Seamus Blackley shared his experience on Twitter, saying, Using a non-destructive process and careful sterile technique, we believe we can actually capture dormant yeast and bacteria from inside the ceramic pores of ancient pots. We sampled beer and bread-making objects, which actually have been in regular use in the Old Kingdom. This crazy ancient dough fermented and rose beautifully. Here it is in the basket, just before being turned out to bake. So, long story short, he baked that dough using that ancient yeast. Tastes nothing like the sourdough that we're familiar with today. It had a much richer and sweeter flavor. Disney is looking to reimagine movies like Home Alone, Night at the Museum, Diary of a Wimpy Kid, and Cheaper by the Dozen for its new streaming service, Disney Plus. Oh, Disney not coming up with new ideas and just reinventing the old ones are perfectly fine? Yeah, sounds about right. Finally, actress Dakota Johnson seems to have closed that gap in her teeth and fans are reportedly heartbroken over it. Thanks for stopping in to check in on your 5 to Know. I'm Nat Cardona. See you tomorrow.